So what is going on guys? My name is Noel. Welcome back to the channel. Um, immediately after finishing season two, we're jumping straight into season three. And I I haven't played this season, this or the fourth one, the final season. So um I'm going in blind and it actually kinda has me a little like I'm excited but I'm a little nervous. So um uh, I don't know. Yeah, I probably should have waited a little long. I don't think I'm ready for this. Oh, as for the alternate uh, openings, um, I don't know. I I think I'm probably gonna have to put them before, or I, I don't know how I'm gonna do it. But I, most likely, I think I'm gonna put them before my actual choice, and then we'll just follow my choice. Okay. So, without further ado, let's just get straight into it. Why would you start a new story? That's kind of stupid. <laughs> All right. Here we go. <sighs> Oh man, I'm not ready. We got a phone working. Hey, it's time. Get over here. All right, I'll uh, I'll start packing up. Now, Javi, you need to hurry. Look, I'm not giving you shit. Okay, I'm just. You weren't here when Dad was sick. Okay, I get it, but. You need to fucking be here when he goes. I know. All right, I'm just on my way. <laughs> David! It's David, hey! Hey, David. I had to leave my car. It's traffic's just it's backed up for miles. He's dead. Damn. No. No. I, I, I tried. You're a piece of shit. You know that? One time. Just the one goddamn time that you needed to be here. Shit. So I'm Javi now? I tried. Please, I tried. Oh, you tried. You fucking tried? Damn. Everyone's here. They've been here for days, and where the fuck were you? <clears throat> we're there, all around him. People who love him, all around him. And he's scared. I'm seeing the panic in his eyes, and he's searching the room. Donde esta Javier? Donde esta mi hijo? Damn. I'm there, right beside him, holding his hand. Like a good son. Uh... And he doesn't even see me. He doesn't even see me because he's looking for you. Hmm. You don't think there's a million places we'd rather be? You don't think we all had to make sacrifices? He was my dad too, all right? I mean, you're not, you're not the only one dealing with this. And what a fine son you turned out to be. Uncle Javi, why, why are you fighting? I could hear you from inside. What's going on? We were just, uh, Talking, Gabriel. Right. Hey, your uncle and I are just having a little chat. Mm. Go inside, mijo. We'll be in in a minute. Go on. It's okay. Inside. <sighs> I should call someone, pick up the body. Yeah. Uh, 
I love you, little brother. You know that, right? You punched the shit out of me. With everything going on. But I understand, too. I know. You think I was jealous of you. No, I, I don't think anything. Well, I was. For a long time. You've lost more than I'll ever have. But maybe something good can come out of all this. Because we need you here. It's time to grow up. You can't run from this. Not anymore. I know. You're right. I won't even argue. I'll be around more, honestly. You can count Down on it. it, huh? I want to believe that. I do. Javi. <sighs> Kate. I'm so sorry, Javi. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Let's go inside. Your mom needs you. Oh, boy. What happened? Come on. I already knows. I don't remember this being the opening. This wasn't the opening, was it? I don't remember any of this. Oh Mama. boy. Ay, Dios mío. I tried. I tried. I'm so sorry. He's gone, mijo. He's gone. <laughs> He's in a better place, mama. David made arrangements with your father before he passed. No puedo conectarme. Hmm. Dicen que no hay servicio. Oh my God! Don't tell me it happens right now. You thirsty, baby? You want some juice? Grandpa's cup was empty. Please don't let him turn. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. People's awake. No, it happened. Ah, oh, no. Get in there, Avi. Oh my god. And goodbye.
We need to go. We need to get her to the hospital. L let me look at it. Let me look at it. Gabriel, where's your sister? <laughs> keys! Where the fuck are the keys? Take Dad's car. Keys are on the dash. No, 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 no! Mama, get the kids. Meet at the hospital. Don't take the highway. It's blocked. <sighs> I'll bring the van around. Where's Mari? I, I don't know. Mija. Mariana! From the stars! Mariana, we have to go. Yaya's hurt. Come on, honey. We have to go. No, no, no! Come on. We ain't got time for that shit. Let's go. No! No! It's no! Okay. It's okay. County General Hospital. I know the way. Oh no! Damn, man. That's fucking nuts. So we are Tell Javier. Me, the campfire. Okay. So I guess we're following this group. Man, I don't think I've seen this many. It's definitely growing. Yeah, not a great sign. I'll probably have to put the alternate decisions. Damn it, I left my water bottle. At the bottle. end. Her just got there. Just under four hours. Come on, we should keep moving while the kids are asleep. Yeah. We still have everybody with us? Damn, this is crazy. It looks like the herd is speeding up a little. I thought it was drifting southwest, but I'm not sure anymore. They're grown. Every time I think we should just bed down somewhere and wait for it to pass, I can't shake the thought of us getting caught in the middle of it. It just keeps coming. It's slow, but that almost makes it worse. It makes it feel like we're in control. We should keep moving. It worked for us so far. As long as we stay supplied, we're fine. Yeah, maybe you're right. The van isn't so bad. We'll figure it out. We always do. Ah, oh, shit. Hey, okay. I'm gonna sneak a smoke. I can't believe you found weed. Are you kidding? People were probably growing this before they realized they needed food. Huh. Do you want me to do that? The last joint you rolled looked like a kazoo. You're driving, and I've come a long way since then. Uh, it was like three days ago. <laughs> Relax. Mariana's got headphones on and Gabe is drooling. I think we're in the clear. Damn, I ain't gonna lie. If we were in a shit like that, I'd be smoking some fucking you want weed. Some? Hell yeah, give me that shit. Yeah. Okay, sure. Damn right, give me that shit. Woo! We are setting an awesome example. There's fucking zombies everywhere. We'll <laughs> Don't be alright. Judge me. <laughs> oh, when I found out David had kids, I told him I am not changing who I am around them. <laughs> and when he proposed, I reminded him that I'm not exactly stepmother material. <laughs> mm. <laughs> in point. He was reassuring, but yeah, I could tell he was worried about it. I knew he'd try to get me to change. <laughs> or at least he'd hope that being around the kids more would change me, you know? <laughs> I suppose it did. If it helps, I think you're doing a fine job. Yeah, it'd really help your case if you weren't waving a joint around while you said that. <laughs> what? <laughs> How is this not a ringing endorsement? 
I used to talk shit about all those mothers who'd go on about raising their kids being the hardest thing in the world. Hmm. Gabe's making me start to think they had a point. <laughs> His mood swings are just... Oh, I don't know. Some days I just want to leave him by the side of the road. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Jesus. Obviously. Look, I didn't sign up for this either. Sometimes life decides for you. That sounded deep, didn't it? <laughs> No, no, it didn't. Look, I love these kids, but I could do without Gabe reminding me I'm not his mother whenever he's pissed. Now he's a teenager. Puberty, hormones. Yeah, you know, a little, a little cuckoo. Oh yeah, the second you start getting boners, the whole world starts to get dark. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? It sounds delightful compared to dealing with bloody underwear. I need to get laid. Oh no, Javi! <laughs> <laughs> no. I realized that was an awkward transition. Sorry about that. Fuck! No, I can pull over. <laughs> it wouldn't take a minute. <laughs> it wouldn't be worth it for just a minute. <laughs> uh oh! Mm. Uh, what's that smell? That's gross. <laughs> hey, Mariana, I I think we, we uh, must have hit a skunk or something back there. I already know you guys do drugs. Oh. That's a pretty severe way of phrasing it, Mariana. Don't tell Gabe. He's the one who told me. Oh, oh my God. You're even smoking in the car now? All right. Everyone roll the windows down before you all get contact high. We're about to make a supply stop. <laughs> the thoughts. <laughs> oh, I'm terrible. All right, Harvey, I'm liking you a little bit, so. What the fuck is Clem? I gotta scout the area. A prayer. You praying for our safety, Mari? I'm praying I find a candy bar. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What do we actually need? Uh, a candy bar. Need, Mariana. Not want. Really need a candy bar. Uh, a water bottle? <laughs> All right. Well, let's start with some gas and move up from there. Oh my god! Hi, Javi! <laughs> Woo! Hey, where are you going? Okay, that's cool. Have fun. Oh, Jesus. It never ends with him. I hate <sighs> a fight like that. I really hate it. It's like all Gabe wants to do is argue. It doesn't matter what it's about. Well, that makes two of us. But... We're stuck with them, so... At least you have your headphones. Yeah, but... The batteries have been dead for a couple <gasps> of weeks. I mostly wear them to fool you guys. <laughs> it's easier to stay out of it that way. <laughs> you... You sneaky little... <laughs> That's smart. 
It's pretty smart. Hmm. Be nice to find some dinner. In a junkyard. You never know. These past four years, people have been hoarding all kinds of shit in all kinds of places. Oh, Maybe we could find a raccoon. If there's any trouble, you can find one of these cars. Yeah? Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. And wait as long as you can. Okay. Good girl. Hi, right, Javi. It's me and you, buddy. Let's do this shit. Definitely has a like kind of a different feel to it. I don't know. Most of the dashboard is torn out. Seats are gone. Yeah, this thing's dead. Damn, they fucked that shit up. There was something over here, wasn't there? Or am I tripping? Hey, it really just told me barrels. Like, okay. Now I'm sorry I did that. <laughs> Hey, um, now that we're alone, do you want to take that off? No, that's terrible. Ah, uh, that's terrible. Siphon. Look at this dude just chilling up there. Come to Papa. Something's better than nothing. Barely anything. I'll need to find more. Like I said, something's better than nothing. So it's 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 a tire stack. I don't need to look at that. Bingo. Okay, we got our gas. Back we go. All right, look, buddy, you going to be pissing at the world, or where you at? Oh, he, never mind. I'm not going back over there. Where the hell am I? Where the fuck is Clem at? Looks like there's more to see I swear here. I don't remember this being the opening. This isn't... Uh... Any luck? Some, but not enough. Gabe? Hey, Gabe, let's go take a look over there. Gabe, stay close to Javi. Got it? Oh, all right. Um, I don't remember being this, this being the opening. I remember it's, you, you're literally with Clem and whatever happens, happens. That's what I remember. I don't remember this. Hey, look, there's one they never took to pieces. Good catch. <sighs> Shit, it's locked. All right, here goes nothing. Whee! Fuck yeah. You're really gonna make me do this? Look at all that fuel. This is gonna take a while. Okay. While that's doing that, let's look for some stuff. Always liked backpacks like these. Ah, shit. What's up, buddy? Looks like it came from in there. Well, no shit, Sherlock. Yeah. Stay close. What? Ah, oh, shit. A rundown building, huh? Or a trailer. What? Do you want to look at it, Javi? Why would you?
They got some stuff in there. Might be able to get in through the hatch. Locked. <clears throat> Not gonna be able to pry this open. Damn it. Okay. So we gotta find a way. I'm gonna assume the truck. Or a car. Ransacked a long time ago. Well, no sh- Aha! <laughs> you just keep staring- Oh god, something's definitely popping out in here. You go, Javier. Gabe, come check this out. Supplies? Not the cleanest place. Oh, no more those at least. Mm hmm. Just be careful. All right. So we're looking at stuff. Why would you put your weapon down? That's the shit I, I'll never understand. Batteries. Is that pudding? Are you kidding me? Lucky for you, they put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries. Oh, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time. It's someone else's. What the hell are you doing here? Oh. They followed. Oh, check it out. This is actual, honest to God, pudding. Seriously? And it's not just food. There's a mattress. There's blankets. It's someone's, someone's place. Someone else's mattress. Someone else's blankets. We need to just take our gas and get on the road. This place does have a funny feeling about it. And if Muertos were to somehow surround us. Great. Now I'm officially creeped out. Come on, one night. We bunk down, eat a real meal. It would be nice not to sleep in the van for a change. Please. The herd is coming if it's not here already. We should go and get ahead of it before it's too late. The fence is reinforced. We'll be fine. We found this. Why can't we just enjoy it? Javi, can we? We could stretch out, sleep well for once. Come on, you know it's not a big deal. We've got guns. We can protect ourselves. I don't feel safe. And we'll feel so... Oh, no! I pushed B! No! The kids are right. We deserve a little break from the van. Yes! Kids, go wild. Just stay indoors and keep your ears open. <laughs> Just in case. Cool. You can have your own. Oh, guess what? Uh, now, you can really drown us out. <laughs> All right, kiddos. That wasn't my decision, but I guess my fingers are too fucking big and it accidentally grazed I don't know X. how I always end up being the mean stepmom and you get to be the cool uncle. We should be able to switch roles now and then. Keep the kids off balance. Oh, come on. That's not fair. You're cool to me. Yeah. Wow. That means so much. Really. Grab some gas. We're out of here in a few hours. Hey, uh, wait. But you... You're the cool one, remember? She'd expect it from you. Aww. Oh boy. What the fuck do you think you're doing with our gas? 
Go on, speak up! Well... I'm sorry, man. Look, it's just a can. We needed it really we? bad. I fucking knew it. There's more than just you out here. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. Hmm. I know you got people. Look, don't worry about them. They took off and then they're not coming back. Just up and left you, huh? <laughs> Fan out and look for the others. Johnny, sure. you're with me. All right, damn, buddy, you gotta be doing all that. Hey, you assholes in there! I got your boy. You don't want him getting shot. You best come out there careful with your hands up. Damn. Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people. That shit's gonna make my day. Open it real slowly. Yes, sir. Oh, look, they're gone. Friends had a real face time. Damn. You can't just take what you like. I don't roll over like that. Look, we hardly took any. Uh, really, someone must have been here before us. Look, I, I, I get it, all right? You're starving. <sighs> Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling. <laughs> Woo! That you're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. Keep an eye on this dickhead. I'm gonna grab some cuffs. You got it. Oh boy. Just chill, okay? No need to make this any harder. Look, just, just let me go, okay? Please. Nope. Look, man. This doesn't have to go. What the fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? Oh shit, here we go. If you know something, you better spill it. You don't want me finding out for myself. Fuck it. Ah! Woo! We're fighting now. Guys, get the fuck ah! in here! God damn, damn it! Bitch! Holy shit! Why wouldn't you shoot, Javi? You have to pay for what you done here. Fuck. Why would he throw the gun away? That was stupid. Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Please, man! Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back then. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. What happened to him was an accident. Yeah, right. Keep talking, we might find ourselves in a similar accident. <sighs> Get what I'm saying? Please, you have to believe me. We were just... Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? Damn! Oh, stop! Oh, shit! Oh, no, no! Oh, he out. Oh, yeah. Hey! Shut 
save it. Fuck, man. <sighs> of course. <sighs> Fuck. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> All right. That's good. Just keep looking forward. Ah, God damn it. Please. It just... I need help. Well, that's obvious. <gasps> the way your friend there ran off, oh! I don't think he's likely to come Clem! back and save you. Damn, she got a shotgun? Okay, now don't do anything stupid. Because I'm not as nice as you. I won't hesitate. What happened to the little girl? I can't. Well, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Damn, Clem! Oh, shit. What do you need the truck for? To drive. <laughs> Look at this little badass your here. Up. Close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me. This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Yeah, put it back, Clem. I raised you better Keep than that. Eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just my family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked, and I don't. Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving. In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard. If you let me have your van. Damn! What about us? Be there in one piece, then I drive away. Fuck, Clem! Yeah, absolutely. You got a deal. Good. Let's go. This really necessary? I don't know you. I don't trust you. And I'm not taking any chances. Look at this little so girl. She's grown up. Both of us if you're tied up. Look, I get it. You're being cautious. Glad we understand each other. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Clementine. Cool name. If you say so. <laughs> I'm trying to start a conversation, Clem. Stop it. I raised you better. Ah. <sighs> Look at that shotgun, god damn! You good at that? Look, and she ain't one to fuck you don't with. Wanna talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. Come on, this whole silent loner thing you got going on? Just be real with me. I don't know what you're talking about. Muertos. The herd caught up with us. Damn. Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. That's a lie. Not for a while, anyway. 
Usually, it's just me on my own. Damn. Sounds kind of lonely if you ask me. Well, I didn't ask you. And anyway, I prefer it like that. Poor Clem. So, who's at this junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive, surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. You're a kid! Keeping everyone together like that. Well, I didn't do it alone. My, uh... Well, uh, Kate helped. She did most of the work, actually. Sounds nice. Having a partner. It is. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me, too. What happened to them? Uh. Same thing that happens to everyone. Oh. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Can you do that? Please? Yes. Fine. Whatever you say. Thank you. I gotta earn your trust, Clem. Don't make me regret this. You won't. Come on! Oh boy, man. There! Wait, was that them? That was them! Get to the gate! Ah, oh, shit. Let's keep going. They'll open up! Ah, shit! <laughs> hey! Open up! Shit! Okay. Thank God. I can't open the gate till you clear them out. Can't risk it. We got it, boys. Next. Fuck! These bullets won't fire. Clem! Ah! Fuck off! Come on now! Where the fuck the horse come from? God effing damn it, Francine! One of these days, those doors are gonna close, and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. It's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very like, bad dudes. It looked like they well, ran shit. in. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. Oh God! And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind if you want to hang on to all your teeth. That is. Now head on in. I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. Hmm. It's a pretty cool place, actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. You left this place? Why? The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Hmm. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. Hey, what's the problem? You have some sort of history here that I should know about? Not really. I just... I know what people are capable of. Hey, Javi. Hmm. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. In the middle of all that. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know they'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go this way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. You probably put the wrong ones in there, Clem. Jeez. 
I haven't been in a place like this since... Well, you know... It's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Okay. You wanna look at it, Avi, or...? Looks like someone's in the middle of a game. Damn, look at that shotgun. Loaded. I'm just gonna start talking Excuse to me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves, I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I know you from somewhere? Do you? I don't know I you. I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20-year career. The way I see it, <laughs> nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. <laughs> and that got a lifetime ban? Hmm. Ah, he just wanted to set an example. I was the poor bastard they used to do it on. All I know is what I read in the papers. Uh-oh. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually... They still use money and shit. You're the gambling type? Game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm. <laughs> Don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. Though all it takes is one good hand. He's bluffing. He's got bullshit written all over. <laughs> is that a fact? Oh, she I lost. I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip him. Oh hey. my. Ain't that a pretty sight? Mm. He won. Oh, hell yeah. Nice. Well, oh, calm down, both of you. Thanks for the advice, hon. Oh, How's she wants a drink on my tab. Bottoms up. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Oh, hey, what's Clem. the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal and it's done? What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Because I don't scare easy, all right? And I don't respond to threats, neither. She doesn't need a bodyguard. She can take care of herself. Believe me. Well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clint. Damn! He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. Oh, I'm fucking believable. Look out! What the fuck did I do? Ah, you just cut me, you ass! Nah, fuck this. Fuck off me. Listen, let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy, I was too. We just got a little out of hand. Dude, you just cut me. You could have cut my fucking just eye out. Give me out. what I'm owed. Jesus. You gotta get her under control, man. This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her, which looks like bad news for you. He had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Clem! Drop the gun. Right now. Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you. Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it. You've done enough talking. Did he die? Drop it. There's a herd out there, and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Yeah, uh, I'm gonna protect Clem. 
Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do with Whoa. you. Whoa! Okay, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. Got some nerve coming in here fucking up my bar. Damn, so much for friends. <laughs> I ought to punch your fucking lights out. Both of you. But Eli was a grade A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Oh boy. Hey, thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um, that was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. Of course. Anytime. Well, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Aw, she's smiling again. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Bitch, I ought to punch your lights out. Hello? Hello? And who you might be. I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. Trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. Listen here, honey. Me and you can work something out. Oh, wait, I hold on. I'm treating you in a cage. Like you're some feral animal. Javier. Pleasure's all mine. Is it now? Now, let's see about that wound. All right, all right. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> ah! Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? Because As we can't stay out of trouble. Behavior or something. I've never understood it. Yeah. Well, it takes one to know one. One what? One pretty troublemaker. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you that one. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking. What did happen exactly? What was exactly what? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? Look, things got out of hand. Clementine was only trying to make a point, but then... You make it sound so casual. Best thing is probably for you two to leave town and get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help, well, not that I have much to offer you, but I know a thing or two about losing family. Hmm. I can't get you in trouble, baby girl. I wouldn't want to make any trouble for you. This whole thing's been pretty messy. I hear you, but... Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're going to do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms, and on my timeline. You got me? Fair enough. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough? Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Hmm. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they can need a medic. No, nah, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Hmm. You, you could always join the group. Look, maybe there's another way. Oh shit. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but well, we could leave tonight. We? Oh, you coming with? So Ooh. Herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. If your family does need help. I'll be right there to give it. What? Seriously? When you do that for me. It's just, it's the right thing to do. I think it's anyway, more than that. Of course you were listening. <laughs> I've got to check out some patients, but She's I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah, she's, she's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. Uh oh, Clem. <sighs> I can't think with it. I have. All right, Clem. You're right. 
Trip's got more muscle, just in case. We'll wait and get a ride with him. Glad you're finally listening to reason. Yeah. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. <laughs> and to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. It's gonna be a while before that herd passes. We might as well get some sleep. Oh, Clem. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. No. Little Clem. Oh no! Is this it? Ah! No, I can't do this. That's good. Getting into first gear is the hardest part. Ah! Now just stay Kenny! on the road. Most important rule there is. Now let's try shifting into second. Not bad at all, especially for a first time. You just gotta ease up off the clutch a little smoother, all right? You don't have to make the switch all at once. I want to do it again. You will. And next time, just be gentle. And once we get down to Florida... Why can't you look a little off? Don't, you look a little, a little different. Mark my words. But then again, older, yeah. You too, buddy. Like a little AJ. I just can't get him to talk. It's unusual for his age. Well, the heater's broken. He's cold. Only makes sense to head for Florida sooner than later. Leave all this snow behind, right? Be like summer every day. Hell, I'm gonna have to find me some shorts. Ah, Kenny! No kidding. It's freezing outside. The sooner the better, for sure. No more winters ever again. I remember this being the opening. I'll teach AJ to fish, how to swim. We'll watch the sunrise every morning, all three of us. But we ain't getting nowhere doing 25 miles an hour. Shift her into third. Let's get her really cooking. Well, there you go, Clem. Time we get to Florida, you'll be a better driver than me. Proud of you, Clem. Hey, I really appreciate you teaching me. You know, I, I always dreamed about the day I'd teach Duck to drive. You're the best second chance I could ask for. Only oh, sees her as a daughter. Where's your blanket, goofball? I swear this kid never makes a peep. Who knows how long he's gone without a blanket? The duck was gabbing a mile a minute at his age. Wasn't full sentences, but something aj's a survivor he knows making too much noise will only get him killed but he's a kid kids shouldn't have to worry about that sort of thing <sighs> crap i got it turn the wheel Don't. Clem. AJ? Oh, God. You're okay. Kenny? AJ, okay? He not even worried about himself. Help me up. Come on, Kenny. I don't, I don't feel anything. That's good. No. Clem, I don't feel anything. I can't feel my legs. I just can't get up. Damn it! 
Oh my god, no, this isn't happening. This isn't happening! Uh, let me try again. Shit, shit! Hey, hey! Stay away from him! <laughs> You gotta go help AJ Clem. I am letting you watch those fuckers chew me up. Go, Clem. Now! Okay. Okay, Kitty. Goodbye. Good. Go. Now, goddammit. Hey, dipshits. Come and get it. When I saw this, I literally dropped everything and was like, I fuck this, I will not hey, do Clint. this. We almost there. Hey, Clem. Yeah, we're close. I gotta say, I hope your people are safe and sound. Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it. Oh yeah? Yes, sir. So that's what I'm gonna do. But why she went to bat for you, I've got no idea. Kenny, man, I mean, even, even in the end, you. he sacrificed. You don't know her, for that matter. Makes a guy wonder, you know? No, there's not much mystery to it, Trip. She's a good human being. Yeah. Eleanor's got a big heart. That's for damn sure. Hold on, I, I gotta pause real quick. I don't mean to, but I just have to say that. Like, that's, again, Kenny. Kenny was only the right choice out of everything. Because no matter what, he always made sure. Look, the dude is literally paralyzed, right? He, he sits up. And what's the fucking first thing he says? Is AJ okay? He sees Clem, she's fine. He looks and he says, is AJ okay? Dude's literally just flew out a fucking window. Is AJ okay? I don't care what nobody says. He he loved them, man, and he there was nothing to it. I know a lot of people say guys to stay at Wellington because it gives them the hope that Kenny survived when he walks out. Oh shit. But What a mess. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? Oh shit, the... Uh... You alive there, buddy? What am I looking for? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, this! Mariana's tape player. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Oh, she's dead. Oh my god. You're safe. I can't believe it. You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. I don't even know how long I was in there. Then I heard your voice. I thought I was hallucinating at first. You did exactly what you should have done. I always knew you were a smart kid. Thanks. It was scary at first, but once the muertos couldn't see me anymore, they just passed by. Kate and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were gonna try to make it back to the van. And that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh, no. Oh, shit. They crashed. No. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. 
Of course. They're trapped in there. Ariana, stay back. All right, let's do it. <laughs> Bitch! Woohoo! Good shit. Javi, you found us. Hey, hey, it's okay. I got you. You happy to see me? Kiss her? What the fuck? I'm happy to see all of you. Happy you're all okay. Another couple of minutes. We might not have been. She was waiting for some. Hold yeah. up. You're my you brother's wife. Up. I can't be doing this it shit. really mattered. Yeah, well, that's... Kind of my thing. Listen, man, this ain't Rick and Shane all over again, all right? I wanted to come after you. I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. I thought we were done for. There's no way I would let that happen. Yeah, well, you weren't here. I just was, asshole. showed up and Mariana was gone and we were waiting and, and waiting and then I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Well, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. As soon as we get back to Prescott, she'll patch you right up. I don't want to go trip, back there. By the way, pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. She's right. Who's the kid with the gun? Does she have a name you want to share with us? Or are you going to make me do my own introductions? Clementine's a friend. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? I think Even, so. Even like lukewarm water would be okay. Ah, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? I think so. Right, Trip? <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out. Well, that means no. I thought you'd been to this place. I have. I just, I didn't have much time to relax in my jacuzzi suite, <laughs> you know? Oh, Between no. you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. But you found every single one of your people. And you found them alive, healthy, reasonably cheerful. It's a hell of a thing. Guess I'm a lucky guy. Luckier than anyone I've ever met. The van. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. Don't worry. I haven't forgotten our arrangement. I know it's not the easiest thing to find, but... Cool. What is that, new headphones? Or your old ones? Thanks. <gasps> Mari! Bro, what the fuck? She got shot in the head! She's dead! What are you talking about? Stop! Stop! Bobby, help! Fuck, man. Why? Go! Go! 
Jesus Christ. Jesus. Jesus, I'm so... She just... I know, Harvey. And there'll be time for all that, but not right now. Kate needs a doctor. Which means we gotta go. We got a window here, man. We gotta get a move on before they start shooting again. I'm gonna fucking kill them. I'm gonna kill all of them. You wanna die too? You think that's gonna help your little girl? So what? I'm just supposed to let him live? If you want to do what's right for your family, you'll come with me. It's time to go, man. Oh. here and we finish this. Are you fucking nuts? We gotta get the fuck out of here I've right now. I already killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Trip help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please. Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi. Please come with us! Please! Javi, come on! Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi! Go with them. I'll be fine. Give me a hand here, kid! Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. Woo! Had a girl. Is that a bomb? Javi, don't! Take that shit back! Oh my god, bro, just like that? How are you gonna end it like that? <laughs> like, bro, just like that? Wow, man. That's actually fucking crazy, man. <sighs> Damn, man. Oh, I, I don't know. I don't, that was a crazy fucking ending. Alright y'all, um, it was nice to see Kenny again, even though it breaks my heart to see him go out the way he did. So you, you're a different group. Clem is the side character now, that's what it looks like, unless, nah, she's the side character, cause you're Javi this whole time, you weren't Clem once. So you're following Javier's group. And to think, she got killed just like that <laughs> okay let me know what y'all think I, this shit is wild man i gotta jump straight into the next one so i'll catch you on the next one and um just let me know what you think this this shit is wild